rectal cancer is the most common cancer in Singapore. In males, it is the top cancer. And in females, it is the second most common cancer after breast cancer. But taken together, both males and females, colorectal cancer, it is actually the most common cancer in Singapore. Worldwide, colorectal cancer is the third most common cancer uh, in the world. And it seems to be the highest in incidence in North America and Australia. But Singapore actually comes very close to that. The rising trend of colorectal cancer is mainly because of uh, more awareness of this condition and more people are coming forward for early screening for colorectal cancer, meaning screening colonoscopy and uh, fecal occult blood testing. Hence, we are picking up more cancers than we used to. Of course, certainly um, there are also better um, methods as well as uh, better reporting of colorectal cancer. So the incidence, of course, appears higher as well. Eighty percent of colorectal cancers are sporadic, meaning that 80 percent of our patients who come with colorectal cancer actually do not have a family history of colorectal cancer and they do not have any known risk factors. However, if you do have a family history of colorectal cancer, that would certainly increase your own personal risk. Um, also, patients who have familial uh, colorectal cancer syndromes, such as FAP and HNPCC, would be at much higher uh, risk of colorectal cancer. Colorectal cancers, when they first start off, are very often asymptomatic. But if a patient experiences symptoms such as finding blood in the stools when they pass motion, or if they have a change in bowel habit, we would certainly encourage these patients to come forward quickly for an evaluation. Other signs and symptoms would include uh, abdominal discomfort or pain, uh, having loss of weight or loss of appetite for no reason, uh, as well as feeling a lump or a growth uh, in the abdomen. Current treatment for or mainstay for colorectal cancer is surgery. And for the past 10 to 20 years, uh, we have been doing a lot of minimally invasive techniques or laparoscopic surgery for the treatment of colorectal cancer. And probably what is the most uh, exciting uh, in this current day and age would be uh, minimally invasive techniques such as robotic surgery for robotic colorectal resections. And we also have advancement in technology such as the, using the 3D laparoscope to assist in laparoscopic surgery. The colorectal department in SGH has always been in the forefront of research um, as well as uh, also in public education. So every year we would uh, uh, prepare, we would actually host uh, public forums as well as uh, events to promote colorectal cancer awareness. In terms of research, we also hold a yearly and annual colorectal cancer week where we invite speakers from all over the world uh, to discuss ideas and share research. Uh, we also have uh, been very active. In fact, we came up with the colorectal polyposis registry, which manages patients with familial colorectal cancers, as well as our colorectal cancer database. We have our own tissue lab um, and tissue repository, as well as a molecular biology lab.